Good evening friends, welcome back to Tremendous Tina and I was dying to meet you and I'm so happy to see you guys. So, uh, you know, I have received a lot of messages from you guys in my Facebook page and uh, in my Insta and my WhatsApp that you guys want to know about my diet plan. As you all know that I was 80 kilos before and I have reduced and right now I'm 57. So, uh, I'm very, very, very happy to share this diet chart with you. Also, I've provided you, you know, with lots of options and I've written it down. I've stored it in my phone. So let's start. So uh, beginning of the day, you have to start your day. Beginning of, the, of your morning, of the morning, you have to start with uh, chia seeds or sabza seeds. So you can uh, get chia seeds or sabza seeds, which is also known as basil seeds. In any organic store in Patanjali or maybe in Spencer or in any mall or in any organic store if you don't get that you can always order that in Amazon so chia seeds and sabza seeds both are not the same they are different but you can consume that you know and uh, you just need one spoon of chia seed or sabza seed and one glass of water just you know consume that and after 45 minutes, you need to have your breakfast. Now, for breakfast, uh, you need to consume Loki juice, which is known as bottle guard. So uh, you can either make it a, you know, make a juice out of it, or you can just boil it and uh, prepare a soup. Please do not add any oil because it's the first drink which you're going to consume in the morning before your breakfast. So a Loki contains 96% of water and it's very rich in fiber and it contains vitamin B and vitamin C and it's also very useful for, you know, diabetic patients and also uh, the people who are suffering from very high blood sugar. It's really, really, really helpful. So either you can make juice out of it or you can make a soup out of it. That's it. And apart from that, uh, for breakfast, you can have um, one apple and one boiled egg. Along with that, three almonds and three walnuts. Almonds and walnuts are very helpful for weight loss. And it's really, really, really very good for skin and for hair. And apple is a fat blocker and it's anti-cancer. And as you all know, the doctor says... One apple every day keeps a doctor away. So the doctor tells that, okay? <laughs> so you have to believe. So apart from that, if you're still not happy with your breakfast, let me tell you something. You can prepare palak soup with palak stuffed in it. Make sure you don't use oil. And if you really, really, really want to use oil, please uh, use one spoon of olive oil or coconut oil, extra virgin olive oil. So a spinach, which is known as palak, it's really, very, very, very helpful because it contains calcium, magnesium, it's uh, anti-cancer and asthma prevention as well. And palak is also very useful uh, for the monthly cycle for girls. So it's really, really, really helpful and it's very good for skin, hair and weight loss. And apart from that, still, if you're not happy, you can go for a gluten-free multigrain bread along with very slight, very slight low-fat butter and the egg white. Or you can replace the low-fat butter by peanut butter, but make sure you don't have this every day, maybe once or twice a week. That's it. Apart from that, now we come to post-breakfast. So, that, so that's going to happen between 11 a.m. to 12 p.m. So you can have one carrot and one orange. It's really, really, really very good for skin and for weight loss and for complexion as well because carrot is very rich in fiber and it contains vitamin K. Apart from that, for lunch, you can have two chapatis, two rotis. Here is the twist. You are supposed to have two chapatis or two rotis, but the atta should be multigrain, gluten-free atta. Yes. You will get that in any Patanjali store, in any organic store, or any kind of, you know, shopping mall. And still, if you don't get that, you can always order that in Amazon. Yes. So apart from that, you know, uh, you need to 
have along with that uh, you need to eat uh, chicken stew try not to use oil if you really want to use oil you can you know make it with one spoon of olive oil or coconut oil or you can uh, consume some dal stuffed with green vegetables or palak paneer and uh, if you do not want to have rotis then you can always switch to grilled fish or grilled chicken or grilled vegetables apart from that post lunch is between 4 pm to 5 pm and you're supposed to have fruits that time please avoid bananas please and apart from that now is a time for evening snacks and that's gonna be between 7 pm sorry 6 pm to 7 pm and that's gonna be one cucumber do not forget to drink loads and loads and loads of water that's very important now dinner time and dinner time it should be your dinner should be completed by 9 p.m. It should be completed by that time. So you can have two gluten-free multigrain roti with vegetable, green vegetable curry, again, made up of olive oil or very less, you know, coconut oil. Or you can have palak sabzi or chicken stew or paneer or one ball of chicken stew. Again, I'm telling you or. I'm not telling you to have everything. Please, no. <laughs> and if you're still not happy with this dinner, you know diet plan you can always get a grilled chicken for yourself or a grilled fish or grilled vegetables or grilled paneer consume sabza seeds or chia seeds uh, after dinner and before going to bed drink two glass of warm water it's really 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 very helpful so before 7 p.m if you're very very hungry please do not you know have any kind of junk food i mean you know when you're on diet you feel like you know having some samosas and chaat and you know rabri and palak paneer please 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 avoid junk and alcohol for at least two weeks so if you're hungry so you can just uh, have a cucumber juice or watermelon juice or pineapple juice or orange juice do not use sugar or ice and you can just consume uh, or you can take uh, a glass of green tea. That's really very helpful. Do not add sugar. So this uh, diet chart is really, really, really very helpful. You can try this and also involve 45 minutes of uh, exercise, be it walking, cardio, yoga, anything. But please, please include 45 minutes exercise in your daily routine. Try this for two weeks. It really works. Trust me, it works. So do follow this and uh, you're always free for any kind of feedback and questions. I'm always there for you because I love you guys. Mwah. So please, please, please do subscribe my channel. Ghanti to bajalo. Till then you take care. Bye. Love you. Mwah.